Wow, that was from Urban Outfitters for like $60, right? Uh, yeah, no, try $2 at uh, Goodwill. Hey guys, what's up? It's Emma, and today's video is going to be a thrift haul number two because the first one was so popular and I got so much feedback, so many responses, and so many people asking for another one. So that's going to be today. I went thrifting, found a few amazing things. This is centered more towards summer, although it's kind of a general haul as well. I kind of have a variety. I might have gotten something better than the legendary $2 jeans. You'll just have to see, so keep on watching. So I'm just gonna cut to the chase because this is a, by far the best thing that I found when I went thrifting and you guys know I've had the best luck with shoes for some strange reason I got the Stan Smiths I find sandals all the time I don't know why it works out like it does but bless I just dropped them I have with me Nike Air Force ones ask me how I found these couldn't tell you. They're perfect. Um, these are a little bit worn in and a little dirty because I've worn them so, so, so much over the past couple weeks, but Nike Air Force Ones, a quick rundown, platform sneakers, retro, recently released like last year, I think. Super cute. They retail between $70 and $90, and I got them for $20 from Plato's Closet, and I'm in love with them. They're not only comfortable, but they make me like 5'9", which is so much fun, and I like being taller than I already am. I'm in love with these, and definitely a summer staple, for sure. Also from Plato's Closet is this dress that I normally wouldn't buy or wear, but I was feeling a little risky on the limb. So this is a bodycon dress with long sleeves, not really summer, but it is so cute, and it follows the trend of like the checkers, like... I don't know why, it seems to be a really popular trend with like the Vans, which I really want. But this is a bodycon velvet and mesh dress. You can kind of see it with the camera like this towards fall because it's probably going to be a bit too hot to wear this, but it's still super cute. Next, I'm going to move on to accessories because... I have a shop downtown called Ashby, which is a combination of a thrift store and a few other things because they have a few brands for like jewelry and accessories and stuff like that. So I got a pair of sunglasses. Look like this. They're mirrored lenses with clear pink frames and they are so cute. You put them on, they're like blue from the inside. So I'm just going to put them on you and I'll let you try them right here. There we go. There we go. Anyways, these are really super freaking cool, so these are something that I'll be wearing all the time. Next, I got a pair of earrings. I wore this in my Zaffle swimsuit video, I think, but they're like circles with like fringe at the bottom. They're kind of weird, but I think they're really cool statement earrings. I don't, really, I don't normally wear statement earrings. I decided to branch out, but they're really cool, kind of boho, and they're pretty, so I was like, why not? And these are really awesome, actually. Next, we're going to move into Goodwill, and Goodwill always does me good. I literally always find something when I go there. I'm going to start with t-shirts and then move into anything else. So I hit the jackpot when it came to t-shirts. First of all, I found this top that is so cute. So it's white, and it says Dirty Dancing on it in, like, this really cool script font. And I don't know where it's from. It's like a sporting company, but I love the movie Dirty Dancing. I think it's... Oh, it's such a classic. I love it so much. And this with like rolled sleeves and a jean skirt and my Nike Air Force Ones is so, so cute. I literally am obsessed with it and it's a t-shirt so it's comfortable. I just love it so much and it looks so vintage and so cool. T-shirt is a bit of a joke, more for my amusement than anyone else's, although you're definitely going to laugh when you see it. Um... So it's this shirt, once again, the checkered print, and it says Fakuk, right there. Um, it's French Connection UK, but um, it looks like something else, obviously, and I just think it's really funny. When I wore this to school, I got stopped by every single teacher, and I, I just played dumb. I was like, it's French Connection UK, what are you... What do you mean it looks like something different? Like, 
it's a brand, I'm sorry. Um, I thought it was hysterical. Half of my teachers thought it was hysterical too. Um, initially picked this out and showed it to my friend as a joke, but I ended up putting it on. It's super comfortable, it's really thin, and I like it a lot, and it's just something funny to wear. Also really, really cute, so yeah. This white t-shirt more as the intent of a beach cover-up because <laughs> it says world record holder doesn't say for what well on the back it does so I helped keep the vibe alive by breaking the world record for the most simultaneous high fives um this is my party shirt I think it's really funny because world record holder on the front and I helped keep the vibe alive on the back. I think that's a fun party summer shirt and it's like a 3XL. It's thin, it's comfortable, I sleep in it all the time and once again it's for my amusement more than anyone else's but I love it so. I got two tank tops. The first one is definitely a child's shirt. It fits like a halter top and it has like this embroidered couple flowers and a butterfly and if you didn't see me get this from Goodwill you definitely be like wow that was from Urban Outfitters for like $60 right? Uh, yeah no try $2 at a Goodwill but it's really cute comfortable more of a crop, to crop top also has a built-in camisole so I can go with no bra which is a blessing in the summer girls you know this but it's really comfortable and it was really cheap so you cannot go wrong with those two things Then I have this just plain red tank top it was also like two three dollars I just love the look of a plain simple um, tank top with a few necklaces it's simple it's pretty it's really easy to wear I wore this in my California trip it'll be in the video but it's kind of like a sportier fabric it's not cotton it's like like almost water resistant it's actually really cool and definitely something you can sweat in which is awesome and just a plain red tank comfortable flowy I'm a fan I'm actually already wearing and it's just a black tank top kind of the similar like water resistant slash sweat proof fabric that that shirt was in all I know is that it's way more comfortable than cotton for summer because you can sweat in it and have it not be soaked up and moist but um I don't know this was like two dollars I was like why not it's a black tank top of course how could you not need one of those so I bought it summer thrift haul thrift haul part two if you guys want more thrift hauls or maybe even a how to thrift video because I go in my spare time I think it's so much fun as an activity itself if you want to see that let me know comment like and do not forget to subscribe if you love thrift hauls because I know that I do first ever thrift try on haul because that was so so requested the last time love you guys so much bye Mwah.